uh, good evening YouTube here at uh, 6.50 in the evening on a Wednesday evening. I have gotten Kylie to work and have eaten my dinner. I stopped at Chick-fil-A, got some other chicken strips, fries, and a cookie. Nine dollars later, I don't know, I'm not real impressed with Chick-fil-A. <laughs> I'm sorry to you guys that, that like it, but I I get better stuff at Wendy's, I think. You know, that's just my, my opinion. But anyway, uh, I had tried, so I tried it. Uh, <laughs> here with you this evening to uh, show you that I did take uh, Ron's. I, I know I call him Wally all the time, but it is Ron. Over at Wally's Place 66 advice on this uh, Harbor Freight light and I did pick one of these up today I found the coupon in the September um, catalog flyer whatever you want to call it they put out um, so if anybody has that and wants one of these at a good price he's a regular I think $35 um, and uh, these they're on sale for 20 basically 1999 and uh, they work great And uh, like I said, it's just uh, I'm very impressed with them. Now they do have a, a low low setting like that, and then if you hit it again, you get the flashlight. And uh, I just I think these are great. They stick to metal. I should say metal. They stick to steel. Anything a magnet would stick to. Uh, you can't see it over there, but it's stuck to my light. There you go. How about this? There. You go. <laughs> it's pulling down my line. Ah, shoot. Anyway, it does stick pretty good. So, uh, I'm happy with this. Very happy. And uh, anybody, like I say, wants a work light for under the car, under the hood of the car, I should say, uh, under the car. Now, I've watched Erico. I've, I've been watching uh, South Main Auto Channel a lot here lately. And Erico has one of these, but it's called an Astro. And I think they're fifty-five dollars or something like that. I don't know if he got a discount or what, but uh, they're just like this. And uh, like I said, it's got the lithium-ion battery. Uh, one of the things I did find comical about it is the instructions. Uh, nice big uh, sheet of instructions. And uh, there's that. You would think uh, the instructions might tell you. The features of the unit, you know, how to turn it on, uh, how many buttons to press, or how many times to press the button to get the, the low light, uh, the bright light, uh, anything. It tells you how to charge the battery, and how to remove the battery. That's all it says. That's horses. <laughs> I went through this with the uh, <clears throat> with the Kimi Tech. Um, same thing with this. Only the only thing was on this, it tells everything except for how to charge the battery, or you know about charging the battery. It speaks nothing about charging the battery on this. So, yeah, I don't know who uh, over in China takes care of writing the instructions, but I think they need some Americanization or English Englishization or something. They need help. Uh, <laughs> but this still is a good good buy, I think. Um, I don't know. It can't speak to as, as far as how much, how far long it's going to last. But it's well built. It, it's heavy. It's it's good. Good. Like I said, this this bends, goes that way. It goes that way. And it has catches in it. You can feel a catch. It's very nice. Very nice light. Again, it may it fall apart tomorrow. I don't know. But I'm impressed with it. I think it's well worth 20 bucks. Uh, if you guys do any kind of, I'm going to use it on the bench. You know me. I'll use it here. <laughs> um, I also ordered another light. Um, I can't think of the guy's built built a record. Maybe I can't. I can't think his uh, name. I will flash it up on the screen. His channel name, and uh, he recommended a headlight, which I have been looking for one. For some time now, I look on eBay every now and then, and eh, see, you know, this, that, and whatever. But he likes his this, and I thought, well, I'll take a chance. I was 11, 11.87, I think, uh, 
with the battery pack and all of the stuff that charge it and stuff like that. But it looked like a good one, and he seems to be very happy with it. So uh, I thought I'd give that a shot. So I'll, I'll flash a picture of that if I haven't already. Will and uh, so got that coming. That's an American or U.S. seller, by the way. Um, I'll, I'll put I'll put a link to that in the in the uh, description if I can remember it. Now he he put a link in his also, or I just made a link to his video. I don't know, whichever. But uh, I'll I'll link to something somewhere. <laughs> uh, again, I, you know, I told you earlier that uh, don't do anything usually when I pick up Kylie, but I did do something, and what something was this. And I'm trying to be a little gentle with it because it's not fully cured yet. Uh, that's black, as you can see, I think. And these uh, these stripes here are tape. So uh, I have that uh, pretty good. You know, it worked out pretty good, I think. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna let that sit overnight before I try to take that tape off. I was gonna try to show you what it looked like, but uh, it's still a little tacky. And I've had it underneath the ceiling fan for a good while up there. Um, well, all the time I was gone taking Kylie to work, it's over an hour. And it's been, you know, I, I did, I painted it earlier today. It was probably in the morning that I painted it. So I would have thought it would have been pretty much dry. But uh, like I said, I'm, I'm not going to rush it at all because I want it to be done, uh, cured by the time I start working with it, obviously. Uh, <clears throat> so, <coughs> whatever it was this morning, I still got it. <laughs> I think it has something to do with, Bill does that too, I think it has something to do with talking. Uh, maybe our flapping days are over, Bill, you think? <laughs> but uh, anyway, and I, I I keep blowing bubbles when I start talking, so I don't know. Uh, <laughs> uh, like I said, I just want to mainly show you the light and, and tell, tell anybody that's interested in it, you have uh, till the 30th of this month to get it at that price. Now, I, I can't say, you know, Harbor Freight, they may have it on sale again in a, a month or two. I don't know. But for right now, 20 bucks is a pretty good buy, uh, buy on that light. And, uh, again, thanks to Wally for that. I probably would have never even thought about it because I, I had that catalog and looked all through it. And, you know, until you actually see something, you know, you think, oh, you know, it's just a gimmick or whatever. But this is a good light. I like it. So um, that's that. I'm trying to think if there's anything else. Didn't do anything at all to the fisher, like I said. Oh, I did find the, um, I believe this is the uh, wall wart I will, I will be using for the uh, DDC PS. Uh, this is a 9 volt, um, I think it's a 1 amp, maybe oh, 1.5, I think. But uh, I'm going to try to get that apart and either get it in a box or something to make it smaller. And I'll run this wire here over to the uh, the plate and I'll have to take that end off obviously uh, if I if I knew what that was to I, I might not do that but I don't really know what it's to because it's just as made in China is really all it says I don't like to use ones that uh, go to something that I have that's useful but I've got these all in a big box and I just went through them and started looking for something that was fairly small and I know I bought some 9 volt adapters at one time. This may be one of those. I don't know. But uh, that's usually not the size of uh, plug they have on them. So I don't know. We'll see. And I, I may may just go ahead and leave that plug intact or the cord intact and uh, run a different wire over there to that. I, I don't know. It depends on how I feel about it. But uh, anyway, that's uh, what I probably use unless I think something else comes up that's better. I did have one in there that had a cord ripped off of it, but it was a 12 volt AC, and uh, I don't think that'll work very well. So I guess I could rectify that, and that's a lot of trouble to go through. But uh, so anyway, I also have this. This is uh, thought about this too because this is plenty small, and uh, I probably that would I'm sure that would uh, that would power that yeah you know, meters uh, either either meter you know so because it's a 5 volt 1 amp I think so um, that's another possibility I know this will come apart I've had this apart I just can't remember how to get it apart right now but <laughs> I know it comes apart alright I've blathered on long enough I didn't really mean to make a big long video but 
I just wanted to get the word out about the light and the uh, headlight. Hopefully that'll be in here here. Short, I think it was Nebraska. I'm not really sure, but I think it was Nebraska. Uh, again, I'll, I'll try to post the link to it or the uh, video telling about it because he had a link to it on his his video. So that's going to do it. I, w I really wished I had, I could have got this uh, show. And I did uh, all this one other thing. I did uh, use the uh, center is going to be red. That's what I decided on. So. Uh, Anybody was hoping it would be black, sorry. This is the way I decided to do it. And uh, I don't think it really matters that much. I mean, it's got a tip. There'll be a black tip here, black tip there. I, you know, it, it come out just, well, I like it the way it is. So I hope I will when I take the tape off anyway. But uh, like I say, I, it looks to me like one coat will cover that also because it uh, it's nice. I mean, it looks like it's nice. So, All right, again. Uh, <laughs> you guys have a pleasant evening. Thank you so much for watching, and we will. Ha! Ah, see, we've got the wrong one. Huh? <laughs> see ya.